Sure. So uh, I'm, I'm Joe Freeman. I'm the co-founder and president of Lyric. Uh, Lyric is a, is a premium short-term rental brand, and so uh, we provide you know, full-service operations uh, for short-term rentals all over the U.S. Um, the way we partner with landlords is uh, two ways, honestly. Um, one, we can we can master lease units in their buildings. Uh, we then do full design and decor with our team, um, and then all the end-to-end -end daily, daily hospitality operations. That, that's kind of one model. Um, the second model, which is more reminiscent of how hotels are structured, is a management agreement, right? Where we're, we are then partners with the owner um, in the short-term rental operations. We do all of, you know we do all the day-to-day -day work, um, but financially we're partners and we earn a fee for for our service. So those are the two ways we work. Well, I think this is a momentous uh, occasion for the industry, right? It's uh, an industry we've been in for five years now, but really over the last um, couple of years, and, and even this year, we think of it as really a turning point where multifamily in general and real estate uh, across the board um, is really en masse starting to look at short-term rentals as the, next, as the future of how people will, will travel and live. Um, it's, a, it's a drum we've been beating for a long time, and so it's really exciting to see the kind of acceptance and awareness that now exists. And I think of this event as a real uh, sign of the times. Uh, this event wouldn't have been possible, you know, a year or two ago. Um, and so, you know, we've been excited to sponsor it, uh, mostly because I think it's, it's a great educational opportunity. Um, we've reached out to a lot of our, you know, kind of current and prospective partners to say, hey, um, all these questions we've been talking about, come to this event and you're going to hear answers from experts. Uh, I think that that has proved to be true. I think the content's been really strong. So we're going to participate in the future as well. Uh, to, to expand, right? So, I mean, um, that ra the round we just raised was a combination of equity and debt. Uh, equity is basically to build the team and continue investing in technology and building our brand and those kinds of things. Uh, the debt is really to expand our, our, uh, our property footprint, so um, cover CapEx and things like that. Um, so really it's just to continue growing the Lyric brand and bringing it to more customers. Okay. Uh, yeah, good question. So, you know, New York's an important market for us, obviously, and we've been looking for a long time for, like, the right deal to enter the New York market. Um, we, we, we found the Q&A Hotel, met the Furnished Quarters team, and loved the asset. I'd say from a design perspective, it's everything we look for. It's a, a historic, you know, architectural masterpiece within New York City. Um, it had all the kind of characteristics we look for, and we, we saw in it, um, you know, what we want to be our New York flagship at the time. And so um, we, we basically took over that asset. We've now rebranded it as Lyric. Um, we're going to have the official launch here next month. Um, and you know, Q&A had done a fantastic job building up a, a book of business around that asset. And we wanted to work with them to make sure we could continue to serve those customers. And, and to the second part of your question, um, we're, we're always looking for partnerships that are going to make sense, right, to help us either distribute our, uh, our inventory and, and find, find more customers where they want to meet us. Uh, or to grow our property footprint. So, so yes, we're always looking for those kind of things. Um, you know, I think like any industry that's, the, you know, our industry is relatively new, and I think like any new industry, um, you're going to see you're, you're you're going to see things kind of shake out, right? So, there's a lot of players now. Um, some of them will consolidate. Um, some of them may not make it. Uh, Etc. But we don't believe this is a winner-take-all market. If you look at the hotel landscape, there's, you know, a, a dozen major global hotel brands, and then you know many, many, many more that achieve like real regional scale. Um, we think this market is going to look the same way. So we think there'll be a, a, a small number of brands that achieve real global scale, um, and that the customers love. Uh, you know, we want Lyric to be one of those companies that actually is, is the, the premium brand in that segment. Um, and I do think there's going to be, you're going to see evolution in the way these financial terms work, right? So I think master lease was the beginning. It was a, a great way to kind of introduce this concept into the multifamily world because it was a, a construct that, that industry was very comfortable with. Um, we're really moving more towards management agreements. It's a better way for us to partner with our real estate partners and allow them to, exp to um, earn some of the upside associated with this use. Um, so that's really a direction we're pushing. Um, I know obviously with... We work in the news, uh, 
people are taking an extra hard look at some of these things. Uh, we don't believe that, uh, that, that is just, that that is due to the business model. We think that's just um, the way that a certain company decided to run their business. Um, so you know, we believe the fundamentals are strong, but we think it's a, a much stronger way to partner with real estate owners uh, in a management model.